the nine off safety. I live the street life like I grind in the 80s. My hood all black like the mafia family. Two guns up, salute to all my bammers. Young YGs on the block with the hammers. They stay strapped up the wild out like Nick Cannon. Pop cannons, we don't know how to act. We the boys from New Yitty, so be easy, scrap. Hey, yo, what's poppin', YouTube? This your boy, Kanan 500, and we back with another epic one. This is Feed the Streets TV. On this episode, we're going to be talking about serial killer Samuel Littles. You heard what I said? Samuel Littles. They call this man one of the most prolific serial killers in U.S. history. And guess what, y'all? He's a black person. He's a brother. We always talk about the, the Charles Mansons and the Jeffrey Dahmers. They even got a docuseries on Jeffrey Dahmers. But what about one of our own? What about one of our own? We gonna get to a story about the nine millimeter man. He was all over Brooklyn wilding out. Black person, clapping everything moving, walking around with two nines. Nine millimeter man is clapping everything moving, you know what I'm saying? That was a brother that never been mentioned in a serial killer, in the mind of a serial killer. Cause honestly, he ain't even get caught. I don't remember him getting caught. You know what I'm saying? They swept that under the rug. But guess what? Samuel Littles killed over 93 women and 50 of them is counted for. 50 bodies is counted for. He went from state to state just going around strangling chicks, manipulating them and all that. You're going to see some footage of him just laughing and describing how he caught these bodies and all that. And guess what? He took the easy way out. He confessed to all these murders so he won't get the death penalty and all that. You heard what I said? North Little Rock. Tell me what that girl looked like. Oh, man, I loved her. I forget her name. Oh, wait. I think it was Ruth. Okay. She was a heavy set, big old yellow girl. And had buck teeth. Uh, he had a gap between teeth, that's what it was. And she, she was like a honey colored skin. And she had, uh, like, her hair was not really long. It was, How tall do you think she was? She was about five, seven. How much do you think she weighed? She weighed about close to. To 200, about 170. 100. Pretty, pretty big girl. Yeah. Now, where did you meet her at? Okay, we down there in the right crack house. I was, they were heard by six other girls were sitting on the porch. Uh, they do something crack in there. I stopped to go in there. I seen the girl, that's why I stopped. We stayed together two days. Or oh, more, I think about three days. We was going shoplifting. We went to Sears. We went to a uh, Kohl's, and that's where I got busted. Mm -hmm. so they took me to jail, and she went and stayed in the car. And the manager of Kohl's got, I guess he got tired of her laying in his pocket in that car. He called the station where I was at in North uh, North Carolina South to drop the charges. Mm -hmm. So he comes out and get the girl and car out of They cut me loose. So we were headed toward with that place where Walmart's uh, the original store Then I was hooked off the road and back in the little woods. There's a cornfield back there. I pulled through it, and on the other side of the cornfield was a trash pile. I parked the car, facing out where I could see anybody coming in. So I, I pulled her out of the car. She's too big for me to carry her carry. So I just pulled her out of the car and laid on that trash that was lit there. So was it like a corn stalk pile? Or was it yeah, a bunch of corn stalks. What could you see from there? Uh, I could see the highway. Mm -hmm. And uh, in the woods, is that way. But it's right outside of Blue Rock. I, I was about 10 miles from here. Did you not hear what this man just said? He been committing murders from 1970 to 2005. Just killing women all over the state, man. Salute to China Brim. You started a new trend. 05 always the movement. Welcome to the dark side. I ride for mine and I know safety. I live the street life like I grind in the 80s. My hood all black like the mafia family. Two guns up, salute to all my bammers. Young YGs on the block with the hammers. They stay strapped up the wild out like Nick Cannon. Pop cannons, we don't know how to act. We the boys from New Yitty, so be easy, scrap.